Hey guys, so today I'm going to play Crazy Shade on my laser. She's laughing. <laughs> I want to show you what I did. So, it's, I have a little wall rope here that we're going to be running. So, MakerFlow has this awesome, how do you call this? It's an apron. An apron. Yeah. These awesome aprons. Uh, so I'm going to put one of the logos here, and I'm going to use the UV for it. And I'm going to, for whatever reason, try to not ruin my jeans. So I have a pair of my jeans. I have socks. They're going to see what happened with some socks. And I have this old hoodie. This is uh, one of the hoodies that I got on um, 2014 on Bike Week, on Bike uh, Fest in Daytona Beach. But as you can see... It's already changing color, it's falling apart, and all kind of, it, it's like everything is happening to this thing. It's just about to go to the trash after so many years of being used and abused. But I did a test. So this is one of the first tests that I did, uh, not with a UV because I was curious about it. Uh, and this is what happened. And probably was because the cloth is so, 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 I'm gonna say stress use and everything. I mean, it's just terrible. And then I did this one on the UV. And even though you can see how bad the fabrics is after all these years, this one didn't affect the strength. So I was like, oh, let's try it again and see that this is not a fluke. So I did it on the other side. Here you go. And same thing, I mean, you can see that, you can see this is really, really, really wear. <laughs> and it's not breaking, so that only changed the color. So doing that on something that is so messed up already, <laughs> I have high expectancies on something that is not. So I put this on the side because I don't know when I'm gonna throw it away, okay? Don't, don't push me. Okay, so on gar garments fabrics <laughs> garments is clothes right yeah. so clothes garments was clothes <laughs> in the 17th century but. yeah so grab your garments guy because this is going crazy so we have this one that is uh, some sort of canvas so mark i'm sorry i'm using your bag you gotta go to this convention guys it's going to be epic this year so you gotta go um, so I want to try to engrave on this. So I did a couple of testing already and some things. Uh, I kind of like it. So test is going to help us here because I need to hold this. <laughs> I don't have a way to hold it exactly. Maybe I do, but I don't want to do much. So I want to hold this here. But since this is now an assisted video, I'm going to put a South Carolina logo on it. And for that, I'm gonna do it a little bit bigger, something like this. So for that, she is going to press the star. My, so I love my dogs, but their hair are everywhere, even in things that they never had near. I don't know what to do with that. We don't need to frame it? So it's actually framing. <laughs> Oh, you can see it? <laughs> no, I can't. I'm blind. No, I, I know that it's framing because of the screen that we are on. But... Ta ta ta. <laughs> we are framing it. Okay. All right, so... I don't want you to hold it where it's gonna... She is going to engrave right on my fingers. And she's gonna launch this. So Spread that a little bit more, please. Your hands. Okay. <laughs> Safety first. Completely true. So now you can see. Oh my god, that's kind of cool. This, I mean, it looks pretty awesome though. And oh, no, nope, it doesn't hold. So I melt it or I burn it. So attempt number two. So let me change some settings here. So I'm gonna use. Let's see. I'm gonna use a thousand millimeter per second, 20, 
uh, kilohertz on frequency, one Q pulse. Uh, I think the major difference is probably I can use 2000 speed so it doesn't burn it. So let's try it again. Don't burn it, Daniel. Don't burn it. So this is more hair of my dogs. I don't know why. All right, and go. Nope, we can cancel that one. That's actually worse. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that one's like. Let's destroy this. So let's change the Q pulse, which is the power on this to five. So five is something funny on um, oh, UV lasers. When you go, the Q pulse is the lowest, is the highest power. When it's the highest, is the lowest power. So it goes from one to 20 in this case. So I wanna do five now. So now I'm gonna change this position in this. We're running out of back. Just <laughs> We're running out of back. Start. And yeah. Okay, we're getting somewhere. It's still too hard. Cancel? Yeah, we're gonna cancel that. Still too hard. So I wanna change some extra settings here just to make it easier. And more than make it easier, the frequency is too. I mean, I, I want to say that frequency is fine, but passes, and probably we are hitting this to 0 0.08. So once I find the setting they're going to use on this specific garment, now I'm scared about my jeans. I still <laughs> use them. All right. Hold on. I need to focus this because... that Lisa now we're getting somewhere okay now it seems like we're getting somewhere all right let's see here wait show it to him before you rip it it's not a see-through let me take my glasses I don't see I don't see squat oh that's kind of cute yeah. it didn't come out terribly and it's not breaking. Okay. It's breaking. Yeah, that broke. So another different different do setting that, for that. Try try to do what you just did on a regular piece of this bag though, because I feel like you were a little harsh on this. Well, the bag breaks too, <laughs> so it's not just that. I feel like that was not bad. That was a pretty good setting. Yeah, it was. I, I think that was a pretty good setting. The same force to break the bag. Sorry. Yeah. That's yeah, that's me. Sorry, Mark. I love your bag. <laughs> All right, let's let's go with the apron. This is gonna hurt because I love that apron. Um, I have another one, but you can't use it. Okay, so. What I'm gonna do for this, uh, I have a different logo that I want to put in here. So this is the logo that, for the store that we're opening. And, look oh, my socks. <laughs> look at that screen. <laughs> you no, I'm just, I'm you. All right, so I want to put this logo, so the apron like this, you know, they have a little pocket for the pants and all that. I want to put it right in this line. So, hey, what is the worst that can happen, right? Mm -hmm. So now I want to read it like this or like this. The other one. This? Yeah. Okay. The beautiful thing on this is that I can see the framing. I see the blue dot. 
which means I can see this framing and I was wrong <laughs> where's my piece of paper I thought I would see it but I don't oh well, this is way off so let's move this and I'm gonna change the size one second all right so I'm trying right now if you you're trying to see what I'm doing to I'm trying to line this up properly with a piece of paper to make sure that it's as straight as possible so that seems to be pretty good now I'm going to make sure that the laser is in focus I guess we are good okay so try not to move anything goggles on and there we go. Ready? Mm hmm. The kind of the blue jean kind of clothes. Nice. Oh, this, that looks great. This actually looks awesome. Holy crap. Now, the question is oh, this is not even on the clothes. Really cool. Oh yeah, this is there forever now. That's really neat. That's pretty cool. That looks great. All right, now let's do jeans. Let's see. Oh. oh yeah, the clothes. It's like you're burning clothes. So just because I don't want to wear nothing on my butt, and definitely nothing on the front. Oh, you don't want to do it on the back pocket. <laughs> Yeah, I gotta put a couple of hearts in there. I'm gonna do it in here. Okay. I guess that's Not fair enough, right? All right. Okay, so let's see where the customized logo is here. Oh, look at that. It's about the right side. Yeah, I want to use the same settings. Probably, actually, I'm going to change something here because I don't want to pass it twice. But it's going to most likely go twice so I don't, you don't need to hit it again. <laughs> so I'm setting this for two passes already. All right, so this is in place. Wait, hold on. I gotta take my fingers out. All right. Ready? Yes. <laughs> wow. That looks awesome. That looks so cool. He looks amazing. Oh my gosh. Well, wow! You that can is wild. so now you can grab on Put your. So they can see it. You can you can do things on the pockets and stuff on the jeans, you know, That's with this. And crazy! It's it's just the color. It's burning the color out. That looks so good. Holy moly! So this is this is actually pretty cool because if you have probably we will in. <laughs> insert this, huh? Hold them up straight like that, yeah. Please. We can probably go into insert this into the store option to customize things, yes. you know? Just make sure that the person has another pair of sh pants so they're not on underwear there. They just like putting it. <laughs> yeah, they just put the leg under the laser. Uh, but no, this is actually pretty awesome. That the the crazy. quality the quality is great. That looks awesome. This looks like a screen, a screen printing a straight up. And it's so much faster. Yeah, and no, no paint, and I mean, all the process that you do with the screen printing, this can replace, at least in jeans. 
Uh, a lot of people want to put stuff on the pockets, stuff on the front pockets, legs or whatever. You could do like a whole design around the leg of the boot. Yeah, you can you can go crazy with this. And honestly, don't break. I love these pants. Yeah, this is this is there. This is not going anywhere. Is is awesome. it burning the paint out of the uh, of the fabric? So of your garment. <laughs> uh, but yeah, this is this is great. So I did a test. I'm gonna pick it up because it just fell. I did a test on socks <laughs> because why not? And let me tell you what happened here. Is this is the one that I was doing the test? So on the top where is the elastic? There is a couple marks only. I couldn't figure out uh, a way to do it right. And then on the side. I tried to get marked here, but it's just melting. It's not really working on socks. Yes, they're, they're clean. <laughs> All right, guys. So, fabric jubilator is a thing. Uh, try it, test it. I can tell you that it will work and it will work well if you find the right settings for the right color and the right type of fabric. Personally, jeans are the way to go with this because the apron, uh, the apron color is a little bit more light or less dense than uh, my regular blue jeans, you it know. Still doesn't look bad. But it doesn't look bad. I mean, it, it's there. It's probably a little Yep. It probably a couple other passes. So tweaking a little bit of settings, and the blue jeans it looks just amazing. It's yeah. just awesome. It's, it blows my mind how good it is. Uh, so there you guys have it. Uh, Give it a test, you know, go wild with it. Don't burn anyone. Make sure that the, make sure that the cloth is not on the owner when you're engraving it. And as always, guys, put your comments below. Let us know what you think, what you want us to test. Uh, give us a thumbs up. Subscribe. I don't know where. You should put it in the middle of the video. So subscribe, give us a thumbs up, ring the bell, notification stuff, and fire the laser.